Hello everyone. We went to Norway last week. Um, I was, was going to do a, a video diary on YouTube. It was so frustrating. Um, I couldn't get past about 11 o'clock in the morning without the me battery running out of my phone. I couldn't understand what the problem was. It was only sort of almost towards the end of the week, just before we were going home, that I realised that if you're in a sort of low signal area and you've got your data roaming on, you're trying to use mobile data and all the, all the rest of it, your, your battery just drains almost almost instantly, especially on my old Samsung 7 that I'm recording this on now. So unfortunately, I could, I've learnt my lesson now. I know, I know what I've got to do next. Next time we go away, I will do, um, try and document it a little bit better than I did last time. Um, but... The nicest, I've got to say, the nicest, we went to four ports, the nicest by far was Alden. I don't know if anyone's, if anyone else has been to Alden in Norway, then let me know in the comments. It's a fantastic place. You can imagine you go from the sea and then head 60 miles inland along this long, narrow fjord. And at the very end, if you can imagine um, a, a, a tiny, the, the, the smallest possible village, it only holds about 500 people. Uh, the, the ages aren't even clustered together, just dotted around the mountain side just different coloured wooden like chalet type things and you get off the boat and it's just basically a pub and a souvenir shop and that's it um, but what they have got are these absolutely fantastic views and we went for a walk and um, I posted some pictures over on my Patreon page if you want to have a look um, it's an absolutely stunning beautiful place we did do a the, well, it was it was advertised as the glacier tour bus 30, 30 quid for a 15 minute bus ride um i thought glacier tours was just exaggerating the truth slightly pushing the truth all you could see basically was right in the distance just see the snow on the top of the mountain so i was expecting like ice an ice river that is how i see a, a glacier um but at that point, the battery had run out on my phone, so I couldn't even take any photographs. It was so frustrating. But it was quite emotional at the end, because this pub, it must have had the, the loudest speakers I've ever heard. I was in the shower, and I could hear the, the Rod Stewart song, We Are Sailing. And I thought it was coming from the ship, but it was actually the pub in the, in the little port plane. Um, and then I finished off with this sort of, I can't remember how, um, how it goes now. It's like a like a classical sounding song, um, and all the little Norwegian kids were waving the flag. It was it was actually quite emotional. I was I was almost filling up a little bit. But it's definitely somewhere I'd return. Um, so also this stunning church um, with this little mountain backdrop. Um, like I say, you can see the photos on my Patreon page um, if you want to take a look. So, um, but like, yeah. But, so next time I've, I've I've, I've sussed out the technical stuff now. Next time I go away anywhere, I'll uh, I'll be able to sort of document it much better than I did this time. So if you have been to Wild, and let me know what you think about it in the comments. I'd be very interested to hear your opinions. Or the uh, the other three ports, um, Stavanger, Alessund. Alessund's a nice place, very nice. Um, and, and the other one, Hegsund, I think it was called. That was pretty much, that was, that was just built up. I mean, to be fair, there wasn't a fat like that one, but Alden was absolutely stunning. Um, if you ever get the opportunity to go, I, I strongly recommend it. 